Hello and welcome. Today we are going to show off my build. It's essentially what I like to call a Facebook night. The main bit is the Golden Ritual Spear. You essentially use a great magic shield and then proceed to block everything while poking at them. It serves as both the catalyst and the spear, so yeah. Purpose is pretty well defined. Then we've got St. Tree Bellvine for quick heals, and if you're so inclined, Great Lightning Spear or Lightning Spear if you don't have enough faith. You can always go from Great Lightning Spear and just forego that entirely, and if you don't have enough faith, you can always just go with Med Heal or Heal. And here we have the Great Shield of Artorius, also known as the Wolf Knight great shield in this one. After grinding for at least 30 wolf blood sword grass, you then allow yourself to get this. It's essentially the neat bit about this is that it blocks and resists bleed, poison, toxin. Pretty much every status effect in the game, this thing resists. It's also got a pretty nice weight for a great shield at 7 pounds and blocks 100% physical damage and pretty much 60% of everything else except lightning. It also allows you to use your weapon art, so in tandem with the Onyx Blade, buff, easy, no need to two-hand, and you can just buff and start swinging. Then there's also the Golden Ritual Spear, which you use to cast the buff. And if you're so inclined, you can also buff the spear for 20% stronger pokes. It's pretty good weapon, than the, but I guess I'll be able to show you. The weakness of this build is the dual charm. Essentially, let's see. It doesn't work on me, but at the very least, it will strip all buffs and make this shield pretty much a useless thing unless you've got the stamina for it, but the real thing is the rings. Link Green Dragon Quest ring extends the length of spell effect on a new game, so I've got the plus two version. Then there's the Sage Ring plus two to get out the buff faster. Dragon Scale Ring for the backstabs that people will try, it'll reduce them. And then finally there's Half of a Ring plus two in order to increase the amount of weight you can carry that's putting me under a 68% of my roll weight, allowing me to mid-roll and be able to at least not fat roll. As for my stats, I've got 32 intelligence, 32 faith, and 33 in everything else except luck. I don't use luck. This build is not really recommended if you're using a bleed. Anywho, I think it'd be better just to show you guys, so yeah. As for stamina, you might be wondering, you don't need to worry about it. It will regen eventually. And then, if you get lucky, you might be able to backstab people and shove spears so far into them that it comes out their stomach. Anyway, 